A world where buildings don't just rise, they connect, they float. Where architecture feels alive, like cities are no longer built, but grown. These are not concepts. These are not future. Renderings, these are three real architectural masterpieces in China that make it feel like humanity has already stepped into. 2050 structures. So bold they don't just change skylines, they change how we imagine the future itself. Let's rise into tomorrow one. Raffles City, Chongqing. At the meeting point of the Yangtze and Jiling rivers, a vision appears through the mist. Eight, colossal towers rise from the riverbanks, and then something impossible happens. They connect suspended nearly 300 meters above the water. A 250 meter long sky bridge floats between the towers, like a city hovering in the clouds. This is the crystal sky bridge, the highest sky bridge ever built. Inside it, gardens, observation decks, infinity pools, public spaces where people literally walk above the river and the sky designed by Moshe. Safety and built at a cost of nearly $5 billion. Raffles City. Chongqing isn't a building. It's a vertical megacity, over 1.12 million square meters of offices, homes, malls, and public spaces, stacked not outward, but upward. At sunset, the glass ignites in gold and the bridge glows like a floating horizon. 2. The sliced porosity block Chengdu. Now we move to Chengdu where the city doesn't fight density. It carves through it. Five massive towers stand tall, but instead of solid walls, they are sliced open. Massive voids cut through the buildings, forming sun-filled plazas, open-air corridors, and elevated gardens suspended between steel and sky. Light pours through these gaps like waterfalls. Wind moves freely. Heat escapes naturally. Designed by Stephen Hall Architects, this 750,000 square meter complex redefines what a city block can be. This is porous architecture, a city that breathes. Water features cool the air. Public spaces flow vertically. Costing over $1.5 billion, this project isn't just futuristic, it's humane. 3. Raffles City, Hangzhou. Now, the finale. On the banks of the Chantang River, two towers rise and begin to twist. Not randomly. Not aggressively, they spiral gracefully, like twin strands of DNA shaping the future. Raffles. City Hangzhou's towers curve and rotate as they climb embracing a flowing podium below that ripples like water frozen in motion. By day, the glass mirrors the river. By night, light slides across the curves like liquid. Energy completed at a cost of over $2 billion. This 400,000 square meter complex blends luxury malls, offices, hotels, and rooftop terraces into one seamless form. There are no sharp edges here, no harsh lines, just movement, flow, balance, steel and glass behaving like nature. These structures don't wait for the future. They declare, it China isn't imagining. 2050, it's already building it. So tell me, which one would you live in?